Hello and welcome back to Let's Play Mass Effect Andromeda Part 34. We're going to go ahead and learn a bit more about some of these things. Um, we'll start out with the general logs. Um, Milky Way the departure. Finally here. We're pushing off from Earth. Yep, we'll we are. A few relays first, and then we hunker down for the long trip across the Long, space. long, 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 long it's trip. Thinking about all the hopes and dreams aboard the Hyperion. I certainly have my own. Do you? Um, I'm getting a lot of that, man. Probably not, because you're just sleeping for 600 Sam, years, right? This is a reminder about Dr. Liara to Sony. She's oh, yeah, he talked to Dr. Liara to Sony, um, who I don't know how many of you watching this. Make sure the team gets her research. I'm assuming most of you, but, like, Pretty for sure anyone who might not have played through an expert on the I have loaded Dr. original Mass Effect trilogy Dayton or Pats. watched it, which I recommend you do if you haven't, but if you Hello, haven't Patrick. for whatever reason, you know, just not interested or me. just My haven't heard of it or anything, whatever, you, you know, you do you. Um, anyways, she's so an Asari scientist the from the Milky Way. <laughs> in the meantime, uh, she I'm was one of the squad research. members and main characters I of the original trilogy. And a lot of people apparently think that she was like the best Hello, romantic interest for Shepard or something. I don't I know. Must say, the thought of exploring another galaxy Did I say everyone? If I, I said everyone, I didn't mean to say everyone. I meant to say a lot of people. A like that. It, anyway, you know, a lot of people do, but a lot of people also kind of don't. There is so much I think she's like one of the more popular squad here. members, though. So much potential wisdom to tap. I mean... I wish you much good luck and future success. I think... I mean, I'm, not, I'm, not, I'm not trying to judge you if you if you if you like the aura, you know. I just uh, honestly not sure how people could survive a trip like that. I, I, um, anyway, I could not bear to leave the Milky Way behind. There is I don't want to say I do not like her because it's not that I do not like her. It's, so it's more that she's just not really my favorite. Future success. Honestly, my favorite squad member from the original trilogy is probably. Um, Don's agreed to a scouting mission on Habitat Seven. It's probably Tally, really. I'm well, actually, no. Sarah. Like it's, it's really a tie. Like, my favorite squad member daughter. is like a three-way tie between Tally, Garrus, and Rex. I hate to leave her like this. I really wish you got to do These more stuff with Rex as a squad member, but you know, I understand why you couldn't. I just kind of wish we got a Krogan squad member in the third game. It's like the only Mass Effect game you don't get a Krogan squad member. If anything happens to me, there are. I mean, you do in the DLC, out. but I mean, like for the whole game, you know. Understand. Amazing how life can change in an instant. Suddenly, my career doesn't matter. Uh, well, woman I mean. It sounds like it didn't really matter before, anyways, if you're talking about AI and stuff. I mean, really, like, he just he just seems like he cared more about that for, like, a while. Like, it's not a new thing. Let's talk about Sam's development. Uh, Ellen's research. Uh, well, oh, how? So, here's the irony. My research on biotic implants and also caused this stupid disease. Oh. But maybe it'll save me too. Yeah, that is kind of ironic, don't you think? Hey, this is my secret log. No, it's anyway, all of our secret log right because of communism. Joined with the right type of AI. Uh huh. Actually, bolster human physiology. Even right. Even if the disease is trying to kill me, the implant and Sam are counteracting it, keeping. Are balance. they? It doesn't sound like they're Result, doing it very well. I get to hang around a little longer. Maybe collect on all those anniversary dinners this guy owes me. Well, that would, that would be nice, right? All right, well, let's listen to the Geth mistake now. Historian, how do you view your people's uh -huh. how does he re how does he view his people? Well, we banned artificial intelligence. Right, I mean, I mean, it kind of is, you know, but given what they went through. That was taking a hammer to a rather delicate nail. Which was? Yeah. One, the very thing that sparked the revolt. Which the was? Who asked us, Creator, does, does this, this unit, unit have a soul? soul? But how could it have a soul? Hey, Geth had no meaningful perception. You don't really of know that, do you? The diversity of experiences we take for granted. Horse. Do you? The Geth saw us as the creator. 
was it? The revolt was inevitable. Well, how do you when know they experience. resented it? And they resented it. Like, really? How? Uh huh. The shadow broker. The shadow broker. Chief provider of intelligence in the galaxy. Will they? I mean. What does reneg mean? Uh, anyways, benefactor. Meeting has been a factor. meeting yesterday. I thought it would be with Jan uh -huh. Garson who founded the initiative. But it wasn't. But it wasn't. I guess Jan's uh -huh. the visionary, the one who gets everyone excited about the project and grumps uh -huh. publicity. But then this benefactor apparently provides resources and money. And you mean and a mean lot of money. Lot of money. Yeah, there's it's actually a like um, a theory I heard. But and I don't know how true it is, but is that the benefactor is actually probably the elusive man. Knows anything about this. Worth talking or at about. least a Cerberus agent working for him. I accepted the initiative's offer. They're calling me a pathfinder. No, I'm not going to say that it's not no true, left. but at the same, same time... Happen without their help. I don't know, it seems a little out there. Well, I, I mean, you are working on AI, There's something strange which is, you know, highly illegal, like highly, but highly illegal. Ellen's getting worse. I can't fail her. And yet you did. Encrypted that log is not currently accessible. Uh huh. Unlocking my memory array may enable it. Uh. Oh, okay. I need to go speak with Tan. Um. What's the What's the other one that's Needing to be do. Oh, right. Right, 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 right. I don't think I'm going to do those two quests. Because, you know, I don't really feel like doing them, in all honesty. I mean, I'm, I'm going to be honest here. I just do not feel like doing them. I want to go do, um, I want to go finish Rider Family Secrets because, you know, it's not much longer, I don't think. Like, not really. We gotta go speak with Tan, and that's also where we're going to pick up the movie night progression for getting the film. And then, I think after that, I think it goes on hold until somebody wants to talk to us. And then we got people that need to talk, or whatever, and blah, 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 blah. You know, I wonder if I need to talk to Liam to get his thing to progress. Or if I just need to get the movie. Um, I'm not going to be taking on new missions at this point. What's this? Oh, right. Uh, no. I'm just... I'm just not going to take the new ones. Like, I'm just... I'm, I'm sorry. I'm just not. I'm just so... We're just so close to the end. And I just... Damage control. Damage control. This isn't, this isn't the one I need, is it? No, it's over here. Return to the movie, return to the, yeah, okay, I need to go to the Tempest now for that. I think I'm just going to talk to Tan and get the Meridian thing, because I think you can't really avoid doing the Meridian thing. Hello again. They're waiting for you. Careful. Uh-huh. Ryder made a sentimental choice saving those Krogan. He looked at them and thought of you. Or, Riders or, and hear me person. out here. Just admit hear me you out here. Don't, like don't fuck yourself. <clears throat> that had nothing to do with the it. The Pathfinder. Ryder, we were just discussing your encounter with the Archon. I did what I had to do, no and to if both. you want to, if you want to chew me out Such for it, you can go fuck leadership. yourself. Nevertheless, it is good to see Ark Parchero reunited with the. Because Nexus. you know what, I saved you the Ark, which is more than what you asked Hats ever did. He had a map showing the location of Meridian. Yeah, he did. Now we have it, and a short window to get there. It's the control center for the terraforming. Well, network. you think this is a terraforming that working, network, but there's a lot more, isn't there? Based on what data? Maybe. This is I don't all know. alien science. The vault on Aya suggests that Meridian is the key. Does it? While I appreciate you know? what you've done for our strike teams, we're not equipped for a war with the cat. 
War with the cat the is coming whether we like it or not. You, you can, you can bite nothing, me. I guarantee there's a fight coming. The Archon's already studying how to exalt us. He already it's succeeded in exalting Krogan. Still, it's better to focus on the outposts. If the cat attack, at least our people won't be in one place. Then uh, there's this Sam of yours. Uh -huh. We took a chance letting AI get involved. Frankly, so I'm uncomfortable with basically, this is the story be beat. This is the same kind of story beat that happened in the first plan. Uh, Council didn't support Shepard, so, so others I. did. I agree. Rider when it came to the final to confrontation. I applaud the gesture, but you answer to me. I hope you understand. Oh, you feeling threatened? What's the matter, Tan? Don't want anyone else overshadowing you? Yeah. It's not called the Pathfinder Initiative. The chain of command has to be respected. No, it really doesn't all. when you're a bunch of morons. Why am I surprised? I don't exactly have a plan B. Uh-huh. There may be a way. Pathfinder, apologies. There was an urgent message for you. They said your sister is awake. That's good, what? right? Go. We'll talk later. In the tech lab. Uh, yeah, no, you don't really get a choice. You gotta talk to her. Um, which is kind of annoying because I was hoping to just talk to Tan about the benefactor. And I think I had one other thing I needed to do. Talk to him about, and I think it was involved in the first murder. Actually, I don't think we ever did that. Huh. Sarah. Yeah, he's awake now. Like, for awake. Hug. Bring it here. Man, it's good to finally see you. Well, you, you could it's see good her. To see anything. But... I was starting to think I'd never wake up. Aw, oh, it was touch and go. You, you almost died. A condition like that? No one was sure what would happen. At least I got to be first at something. First woman in Andromeda to wake up from a coma. Dad ah, well, said you're at a point the there. Victories. Won't be many of them. Mm. Yeah. I'm sorry yeah, I wasn't there um, when he died. There's speaking of that, if you gone. lie to her, I think she finds out and gets like sure super pissed you. at you. I'll miss him. And uh, if you lie to, to the male writer, if you're playing female, the same thing happens. Just switch the pronouns. Oh, there's been plenty of that. So, so yeah, um, Mr. I think they eventually get over it, but at first Not they're like choice. super pissed at you. But honestly, I think it's better. From to the sounds hear of it, the truth. you're going to need all the help you can get. For the most part, I mean, there there are some things. Careful. Where I'm like, maybe it's no not way are you fit best for duty, to hear miss. the truth. That stubborn skull of yours needs a chance to heal. Says who? The Pathfinder. The Pathfinder. That's who. Time uh -huh. to rest up. That's an order, Specialist Rider. <sighs> yes, sir. Pathfinder, sir. Well, I wish my boss was like that. Are you kidding? <laughs> <laughs> I saw you eat your own boogers when you were six. Okay. If you want to catch up some more, that's fine. That's not a line I've ever heard before. Bed. Uh Ryder, this is Pathfinder Ricks. We have some ideas about uh -huh. radio. Come by the tech lab as soon as possible. We'll do. Um yeah, I'm gonna I'm gonna I'm gonna do all the side quests we have here first, really. First. Anyways, yeah, I'm gonna I'm gonna do all the side quests we have here first because you know, um We're already here, right? So you know why not, right? So um, yeah, when we, when we, um, when we, when we go to leave, I'll do that, but uh, that's probably going to be the last thing we do before we leave. Um, like I said, I think we've got a couple of things to talk to Tan about, and that's like, um, well, I don't really remember. I don't remember who you are, and I, Dullers? Sellers? Yeah, no, I don't know who you are, and I don't want to talk to you because you're just going to give me a new mission that I'm probably never going to do. How are things? Ryder, I uh -huh. trust there are no hard feelings. Fuck you. As tempting as Meridian may be, caution must guide us. But it's what I do. Director, it's my job as Pathfinder to take risks. Meridian is our chance to find a home. Uh -huh. What else matters? Living, Avoiding probably. Avoiding wholesale slaughter at the hands of the cat, for one. That could happen anyway. Uh -huh. It's worth the I mean, risk. it really will the happen. Disagrees. That's our final word. Yeah, Did I don't really give a business? shit if you disagree. I'm curious. What do you know about the people who backed the initiative? What everyone knows 
Uh -huh. Jean Garson was the founder and visionary. Unfortunately, she died on the Nexus. But during what if it wasn't disaster. an accident? Is there anyone else? I would almost welcome them. A voice to silence the rabble. Then Kesh. Yeah, Anderson. notice how the only no, person he's alone. really calling the ask? rabble is Kesh. Like, like no, no, like, like no. He's she's the only one that she he specifically calls rabble. <clears throat> Wishful thinking. <laughs> no reason. Guess I was hoping the cavalry was on the way. Yes. Uh -huh. If only she'd left. No, Gian Garson was the beacon. A sad yeah. end, someone of such stature. Uh, dying alone. I mean, that's, oh. that's kind of sad it for was anyone. chaos. By the time they found her, she was already dead. Succumbed to her injuries. Well, that sounds convenient, man. That's some kind of luck. Dying after mm. a 600-year trip she organized personally? No one ever yeah. said fate is kind. I if mean, you're suggesting yeah. something else happened, Ryder, I'd rather you didn't. Let's not add to the confusion. Thank you for your time. Uh-huh. Yeah. Uh, right now, if you wish to pursue this further, accessing Nexus security records may reveal more information. It's like Sam knows me or something. Oh, hey, I wanted to show off one thing while we were here because this is like, I think, the second time we've been here. Got a hollow planet. Yeah, it's just a generic planet, though. And you can come here and look at all of your planet's viability, which all of ours are at 100. Which is uh, perfect, because, you know, everything's 100% viability, it means I can just bugger off and do whatever I want, right? Right? Probably not. Look, okay. security footage. Garson. What are we... Oh. Okay. Hmm. The only hard fact is that her body was found in one of the apartments. Then connecting her death uh -huh. to the Scourge disaster was mere speculation. Exactly. Yeah, they just wanted this to go away. I think we need to check out that apartment. Well, that would be a bad idea. Will allow us to reconstruct the scene. That's awfully convenient, you know? So let's go to the apartment where she was found dead. You know what? This is a lot longer than I really thought this quest was. This might actually take up the whole episode, just this quest. And it's not because a lot happens, there's just a lot of talking, and the talking takes a while, but I don't want to skip any of it, because, you know... Uh, context. It's important, you know? It helps us understand things. Like a lot of things. Like a lot of a lot of things of a things, things. I'm gonna stop talking now. Arr. Well, I'm not sure what that noise was, but it wasn't talking, so technically I didn't lie. What do you want, you wall? Okay, it takes a ridiculously long time to turn around, it seems. I don't really want to speak with the protesters. I, What apartment am I looking for here? Well, I know there's a data pad in one of them. Oh, must be this one. Scan the room for clues. This is where Jean Garson's body was discovered. Really? I never would have guessed. What are we guessed. looking for? If you scan the room, environmental uh -huh. data may allow... People? There. Uh huh. So people. This was no accident. That's she speculation, and I don't As even see where we can get this. Ago, it's just this from environmental sensors. Now. Yeah. But wait, this whole area was shuttered back uh -huh. then. Yeah. Didn't open until the Hyperion arrived. So what was Garson even doing here? Uh, probably meeting with a uh, person. There's a fake a door door. here. What do we have here? Fake door, hidden door. Fake wall. Two data pads. Oh, uh, I thought this was gonna have reading, but uh, oh, there we go. You you gonna play? This is Gian Garson. Oh, there we I go. I don't have much time. I've been hiding in the sealed off sections of the Nexus since we got here. Someone's trying to kill me. That reminds me of um, them down in the Liara's area. mom's voice or er, father what I know or whatever. In VI in the cultural center. I think I think this she was the, the code, quote father unquote. Oh God. But she was like an sorry. Was a bartender. Wow. Like it's not. This is some serious it's not shit. on the same yes, level deep of troubling. deepness, but I the coach you mentioned that's, that's what I think of. You know. Uh, entry one point one twenty eight nineteen. In twenty one seventy nine, once mentioned, a storm is coming. 
said evidence was clear. Meaning? Andromeda, why? Hyperion still no contact. Where is Alec? Did they get him too? Garson notes. Uh, what is, what is the objective marker telling me now? Oh, right. You know what, since that won't go away, what the hell do the protesters want? I don't care, but it's not letting me not see that. Where are they anyways? They're down here, right? What the hell do you people want? Stop bothering me. I'm working. Well, if you want to talk to me, talk to me. Free our families. Oh. Wait, what? Hey, what's going Tell on? Our leaders. That's Make your new sleep. galaxy. Uh. Making speeches about some fresh start while your kids stay free. Yeah. Um. And it's all thanks to your Pathfinder. Well, I don't... Excuse me? We've waited uh -huh. months for our families to come out of stasis. They should have gone to your outpost. Well, uh... But since you think research is so important, well, Personal sorry that I think not list. starving to death like takes priority orders. over who can shoot the most All things. Huh? Huh? I bet you feel guilty middle. now, you random assimilation of pixels that can't even hear me. Ah. Uh, that was a noise, and it was me trying not to cough. I had to make a choice. We only had resources for one outpost, so I focused on the skills we needed most. Right. And what we need is our families back. Well, I feel for you, man, but... Right. I just want Mom out of stasis. That's all anyone here wants. You do stasis revivals. You can tell our leaders you're opening those pods. Ah. Uh, Today. Fine, I'll talk to them. Okay. I'll talk to the leadership about what we can do. Fourteen months of promises. Uh -huh. It's time for some results. I'm probably not Try actually going to do it, you know this. She ignored us. Screw her. Okay, on that Start we can agree on. He said those ten soldiers over there. Maybe he'll take us seriously. Uh huh. Um. I'm just, you know, I'm gonna go. Why is it telling me to go up there? I was. It's not tracking that, is it? Well, isn't the cultural exchange over here? Why is it telling me to go up there? What? I'm confused. I, I don't think... What are you so upset about and why are you wanting to yell at me? Hail the man of the hour. Yeah? What did I do? Word is you killed that traitor, Sloan Kelly. Oh. Just wanted to say thanks. I didn't, but okay. I'm not the one who killed her. Not how I heard it. Just accept uh, the pat on the back, alright? No. She got what she deserved. Uh, I don't know. Oh, right. This is the first time we came here, so we gotta sit through the cut scene. Weapons. I prefer them armed for now. Yeah. You understand, of course. No. Oh, Pathfinder. This is the head of the Angaran delegation. The one who saved the Moshai. Ah. She speaks high. Well, that's good. Call me. Issa de Navarre. Well, this is a historic day, man. Welcome, Ambassador. The Angara's first formal visit will be one for the history books. Will it? I wonder what they'll say. I was just explaining to the Ambassador that armed guards aren't necessary here. Well, if it makes him feel safer... Is something wrong, Ambassador? Please walk with me, Pathfinder. He doesn't trust our guards. Also... Um... So much yeah. life. All different, all united, the way it could have been. If not for the cat, yeah, yeah, ago, yeah. We were scattered, struggling to rebuild after the scourge. Then the cat arrived. How dare they? Alien life. It uh -huh. was monumental. But then they deceived and enslaved us. Yeah, they did. So I hope you understand my precautions. I do understand. Your people have endured much, Ambassador. I'd be cautious too. Yet all this, your initiative, is proof yeah, that it is. better way. Yeah, it is. Kind of, I, I guess. Even though we don't Pathfinder. even get along the for the says most you're part, trustworthy. really. Please, help me trust in you. The cat hate us. Use that. Right now, the cat are distracted by us, the new arrivals. 
That can only help the Angara. Yes, it can. You'd draw the attention for us. We, well, hey, I mean, we it's already again. have, anyways. Someone might as well benefit. They'll right. surrender their weapons to your militia, if that's satisfactory. Thank you. We won't disappoint you, Ambassador. Yes. A boa set draft Aravon, Pathfinder. Welcome to Andromeda. Yeah, that's uh, that's how long ago that was supposed to happen. Like, it was supposed to happen pretty much after first contact, I think. Your species are monogender, correct? Uh -huh. Welcome to the culture Scan exchange. to assess the nature of the damage. Please have a look around. Scan what? Welcome back. Hello there, neighbor. I'm Gia uh -huh. Carson, the founder of the Andromeda Initiative. I thought you might like to hear more about our plan. Why is it so echoey? Sam, can we hear that message Garson talked about? Yes, can we? I'm it now. Rerouting to our private channel. Yep. For years, there was a silent partner involved with uh -huh. the initiative. Who? The truth is, I was running out of money. Then a benefactor stepped in. Uh -huh. I didn't ask questions. I never met them face to face. That was a mistake. I lied to everyone. Yeah, I'd be more Something surprised if a government didn't lie. Way, and now they're moving 100,000 of us to Andromeda. Uh -huh. I hope it's all for the good, but I have is my it? doubts. And now I think they're going to remove me. Probably. Alec Ryder and I had a code word for this. Fulcrum. Fulcrum. He may have learned more. Probably. What did that mean? Something and then that unlocked the, the last memory. Perhaps the answer is in your father's final locked memory. It is now available to view in a sound node. But. Let's go check that out. But what I'm going to do first is I'm going to go model of the spheres. What? Oh. Yeah, um, I don't really know what those are, some of them, really, not really. Uh, let's go meet PB, and then let's go meet Gil, and, yeah, Drac, what is this? I don't know. Yeah, let's go meet PB, Gil, and Drac, and then we'll go do the Ryder Family Secret. Because I, I just I just kind of want to do everything that we have to do on the Nexus right now. Unlocking. Come on in. And also, this will unlock a new thing for us. Anyways, a new power, kind of. Ta -da! Under tech. My project. She is complete. She. She. Looks like a she to me. Fair enough. Just a proof of concept. I stripped uh -huh. out its remnant command prompts to see if I could power it up myself. Did you? It worked. Now I can build a field model with combat protocols that fights for you. Oh, cool. So, uh, what do you think? That's amazing. You've outdone yourself, PB. Let's zoom I in want your three eyeball, of them. Then fast track the combat model for me. I'd hoped you'd be happy. Uh, very. Oh, no, very I forgot happy. to lock the... Shit. My, my, uh -huh. Belisaria. Didn't Who know are you? Still using this hole. Who's your friend? And why do you have face paint? this is Ryder. Oh, everyone knows the human pathfinder. Uh -huh. I meant, who's your remnant friend? None of your uh, business, Kalinda. Of course it isn't. It's That's a lamp. It so it's a very don't be so fancy hostile, lamp. Uh, I don't know. Hostility seems fair. I don't know. Don't what be so condescending, babe. Ah. This is PB's place, and you're trespassing. I'd say that warrants a little hostility. Now, now, uh, yeah. I was just concerned Pretty something much. might have happened to my dear old friend. Uh, well, you don't I'm sorry seem for like the intrusion, friends. Pelisaria. I'm just relieved to see you moving on. Uh huh. Ta -ta. I'll walk you out. Why are you talking about tatas? This isn't the time so, or the place. Want to talk about it? Oh, uh, Linda and I go not. way back. We joined the initiative together. For a long time, well, we were like I guess family. you do, huh? Now we're not. When you live a thousand years, Ryder, people come and people go. Entanglements are silly. Uh huh. It's like places. Time to pack this one up. I'm done with it. Not much to give up. Shouldn't be hard to leave. By design. Easy yeah. come, easy go. Uh, yeah, this is just telling us that we have Pock. Or, well, actually, not Pock. We have Zap. I'll pack up my new pet and essentials. See you back on the tenth. Uh, so that one is called Pock, but really, it's, um,. It's just, it's really just like the combat thing, but it's only purpose in life is advancing the story slightly. Well, not the story, but you know, 
PB's mission. It's it's that's, that's really all it's there for, and also unlocking the ability to have a combat version that you can call down. Hello, birds. Yeah, it's cold. It's probably gonna snow today. So yeah. I really hope it doesn't though, because it's not supposed to even rain, let alone snow, and also if it snows the power will probably go out. If it goes out while I'm doing this, well, I'm going to be very pissed. Hello, Gil! So, Ryder, big news. I think I found my purpose in life. Have ya? Oh yeah? What's that? Uh, poker. Thrashing you at poker? Shall I deal? Shall you? I can read Gil's vital signs and give you an advantage during the game if you like. No. Don't. Alright? You can deal first. See, you know, wait. Well, yeah, even people, other people think it's weird Getting because all he really has to do is think it. You know. Luca's lost me several friends over the years. Uh huh. The only one who still plays me is my buddy Jill. I, I know. I know. Jill. Well, is she a masochist? She must be a glutton for punishment. That's her. <laughs> so I know she'll always be there. Oh, Jill's an intelligence enough. expert. Fair enough. Heads the initiative CRC. My only real friend from back home. I bet fifty. You bet fifty, huh? I call. The CRC? Colonial Repopulation Committee. Yeah. She's always teasing that I'm making her job harder. Says yeah. if I'm not making babies, I'm part of the problem. We have that kind of relationship. Okay, repopulation is important. Growing our numbers is paramount to our survival here. Sure. But that's Jill's purpose. I'm not just going to adopt it. He See says, but... You know, uh, I'm not just no. going to adopt it. Ha. I saw you should meet her. You'll see. She's amazing. Another hundred. She sounds I real fall. amazing, yeah, huh? What? Another one for me then. Well, that's yeah. that. You win. I've achieved my true So do I actually life. lose real credits for this? What will I do now? I'll beat you Revenge next time. Revenge will be mine. Uh-huh. Someday, maybe. Jill predicted you'd be my downfall. Can't wait to tell her she was wrong. Another streak intact, I'll say. Ouch. Have fun. And thanks for the game. Do I lose actual credits for this? Apparently not. I wouldn't really care if I did. I mean, basically get infinite credits at some point anyways. Like, this game has this thing where you can get, like, infinite credits. Because, um, basically you can loot the enemies. And then the enemies like respawn in a lot of the places, so you can just basically. Is there another person? Yeah, I need to meet Drac. Um, or we'll find Spender. Anyways, what's his face? Uh huh. Your incompetence isn't my problem. Right. Just do your job. Yeah, Spender's a kind of a douche. What do you And not want? very good at what he does. Calm down, man. Whatever's going on, it's not fair to take it out on me. Apologies, you're right. This is not your fault. That guy's a From jerk, what I heard huh? just now, he's a bona fide jerk. <laughs> That's putting it lightly. Yeah, just really, last week, it is. He tried to redirect some of the supplies we need to keep the stasis pods going. Yeah, oh. Why? Wow. I have no idea. What a dick. But if Kesh hadn't stepped in and threatened to airlock him, it would have been a disaster. Yeah, I don't see how like he even that. has a job. Making bad decisions, driving the Krogan away, treating people like scum when no one's watching. How can I help? Maybe can I shoot him? I can do. I'd like to shoot him. A man him. like that's bound to have some dirt. I wish Tan and Addison could see it. No, they Things can't. They can't so see anything because they have their heads up their own asses so far because they love the smell How of their own parts. Are we talking here? Boot to ass. Oh, it was glorious. Uh -huh. We need him gone, but as incompetent as Spender is at his job. He's insanely good at keeping it. Yeah, I don't understand that. Like, more. how do how do people manage that? How do people manage to be so terrible, but look like they're doing so good? And um, so the last thing I really need to do now at this point, I think, is um, this is probably just gonna be a side quest mission. Really, I mean, I didn't intend for it to be, but it probably is just gonna be one. I mean, that's, that's not necessarily bad because, you know, I mean, a lot of these past ones really have been anyways. So, I, I, I don't know. 
I mean, I, I guess really there's not there's not really a problem with it per se. It's just it seems like most of this has just been this one mission, really. And that's the problem. These last ones just seem to be like one mission each or whatever. It's excruciating. I do not experience psychological uh -huh. distress. Are you done talking so I can move on with this conversation I want to have? No, and I am intrigued as to what uh -huh. you do. You find me intriguing. You done? You done? Let's see it. A moment. There is an added layer of security. Oh, is there? What was it GN Garson said? The code word is fulcrum. That yep, word. there you go. This is the last memory your father encrypted from the final planning stages of Hyperion's departure. Okay, what is it? Play it for me now, robot man. Castus, thanks for calling. And a lot uh -huh. of people still admit to knowing me. I owe you. Those were good days on the Citadel, Alec. Ooh. I checked with my son Garrus. Do I he hear Kinky? Oh, and hey, that's Garrus' dad. The council thinks Commander Shepard's story is bogus. Uh huh. But privately, I've heard they're starting to wonder. Oh. This threat. They're called Reapers? Yes, they are. Shepard's word for them. Something about a cycle, an extinction event that happens every 50,000 years, galaxy wide. Yeah, it doesn't sound good, does it? And supposedly, the alarm clock's about to go off. Well, technically, at the start of the trilogy, uh, at the very start of the trilogy, Garrus, it was supposed to have gone off before, takes after you. And then but then didn't, and then, so, you the know, it was delayed by coming, another few years. Thanks, Castus. And by few years, I, I, I mean, like, a few years. <laughs> it really wasn't that yes. long. I checked around. Uh -huh. There might be something to this. If there is a war, uh -huh. the scramble for resources will be on a scale we've never seen before. The chaos will be monumental. Yes, it will. We should accelerate What's your point? Table. They will keep the reason quiet. <sighs> Sorry, but I had to scratch must be before any joints for getting achy. We can't get caught in the crossfire. Agreed. Is there Why? Else? Why can't we get caught in the crossfire? Is there something wrong? Years that? ago, you mentioned salvation for a lot of people. Yeah? You knew this was coming. I knew something was coming. In uh -huh. theory. Shepard made it real. And now that you're right... See, we'll this, this just hope. makes me think more and more that it's like we're something to, to do with Cerberus. Civilization. Sam. Yes, Pathfinder? Uh-huh. Track down my kids. Tell them their old man needs to talk. It's urgent. And how is Ellen? She remains in uh, she's... As you hoped. It has suspended the progress of her disease. Well, that's good. Make sure her pod is on the Hyperion. Don't use her real name. Why not? I'll tell the kids when the time is right. So it makes me wonder why she Sam, agreed to this, or if she, she just put her in there without her, like, consent. Memories. <laughs> because, like, she's There's spent all that time preparing for him for, like, her <laughs> loss or whatever. Yeah. I don't know. Mom is here? Alive? Yeah. I blocked all knowledge of this memory. I now recall his directive to put Ellen into stasis. Uh huh. He That's convenient that, you know, he just disease, blocked it so that you couldn't mention could it be before. Found. Like, this should never have been kept just like a lot of, like, oh, what convenience friends. moments in this game. This is the reason you were made Pathfinder, to see the process through. Oh. Where's Mom now? Here so it wasn't just nepotism. Ellen is in a stasis pod under a false name, Elizabeth Riley. Why do I feel like that's a reference to something? Also, ER, emergency room. Now we know what GN Garson meant. That something. I mean, I doubt that's what he was going it. for, but it was you know, these it works. What do you know about them? A Spectre operative in the Milky Way, uh -huh. Commander Shepard, launched an investigation Spectre, in 2183 into the existence of an ancient race known as Reapers. Yeah, they were According ancient, weren't they? You're the really The Reapers smart. invade the Milky Way every 50,000 years to destroy any advanced organic life. Why Allegedly, organic, though? Why do they always mention organic? They're gonna kill the Shepard inorganic the ones, too. Just not as immediately. Is the Milky Way okay? No, probably not. That was years ago. Was Shepard right? Did the Reapers come back? Additional yeah. Additional locks in your father's quarters have unlocked. Their implications are 
troubling. Yeah, they're they're Your they're troubling. Yeah. Prudent, that you have this information should anything happen to him. Uh, Gian Garson's murder. But why was Gian Garson murdered? Probably Recall to keep this Garson's quiet. Words about the benefactor. Now they're uh -huh. moving a hundred thousand of us to Andromeda. I hope it's all for good, but I have well, my doubts. What does that mean? Who was or is the benefactor? See, Unknown. Part of me wants to know where that was going, but I so just, this was Dad's I don't plan. feel like it Anna was going anywhere. The really. of Ellen recovering, only to discover you had died. Uh -huh. He sacrificed himself to ensure you and Sarah could one day be reunited with your mother. I mean, you know, you say what you will about the man. It seems like he pulled through when it really secret. counted. He entrusted you with this knowledge. Additional logs with uh -huh. pertinent information are now unlocked in Alex quarters. So, yeah, I think we I just have time Bob. to listen to those logs, and then that'll be it, and then next time we'll talk to the other Pathfinders about getting the hell off this station and murdering a bunch of people. Actually, next time we'll probably talk to Cash about Spender. Yeah, Spender. That's his name. That, that's the asshole's Your name, yeah. Personal logs. Uh, Milky Way Emergency. We just arrived in Andromeda. Before the rest of the Hyperion wakes uh -huh. up, I've checked our comms for any signals from the Milky Way. Looks like sometime yes. in yeah. 2186. Everything went to hell. Yeah. We got out just ahead of it. Well, didn't Shepard one of the arcs, right. like... Was it, so weren't some of the people on factor. one of the arcs awake long enough to see the Reapers arrive in the Milky Hello, Way? Alan. I feel like it was... This is I feel like it was the, the kitchen sink arc. That's not mentioned until the end. That every species that wasn't the council species. That's is basically what they were. Andromeda. Really, it was a kitchen sink arc. It had the Hanar, Drell, Quarians, Tur, uh, not Turians, um, uh, Volus. Uh, I feel like I'm missing something. Oh, Batarians. Basically, you know, like I said, the kitchen sink arc. Uh -huh. Please, don't forget us. Keep uh -huh. us alive in your hearts, and tell your children of the wonders that once were. What wonders On were there once? Of the crew of the Normandy SR2. This is Doctor uh -huh. Tassoni, signing off. So yeah, Alliance SOS. Please, Alliance personnel, please stand by for an emergency flash traffic message. Uh huh. What's, what's the message? This is a galaxy-wide alert for all human territories. Fleet Admiral Stephen Hacker has declared this? threat condition Saber 1. Enemy presence confirmed in Soul System. Earth oh. under Reaper attack. I say again, Reaper attack is underway. Instructions to follow on Covenant Ooh, Channel. Crimson static Cassidy. effect. Nice. Oh, haunting dialogue. Uh-huh. Oh, yeah. Yeah, everything goes to Everybody shit. And then, uh, Milky Way. Pretty much. In the end of the trilogy. Alec, this and, is uh, Garson. yeah, I, I don't want to spoil the ending because there may be people who haven't... It's about who this is their introduction and want to see what all the fuss is about with the original the trilogy of Mass Effect. Like you're already asleep. I'm very uncomfortable and, uh, anyways... And the fact that we still don't know who they are. All these lives uh, are what was I going to say? I oh, yeah, I don't want to spoil the ending. Or whatever. Troubling, Alec. Even though, Let's if we're being honest, Mass Effect 3 doesn't have an ending. It has a non-ending. Jen, I got your message about Fulcrum. It's now 2819. We reached Andromeda, uh -huh. but have no sign of the Nexus. I have the same concerns as you. I wouldn't have said that, because if you didn't die on the planet, way. then the odds are that the Benefactor would have well, killed you. Something terrible happened there. At least the Benefactor spared us from that. Uh-huh. But why keep hiding? Because... Something's off. But we've got bigger problems at the moment. I, I just... Seven, I feel like... I, I, don't, I don't really feel now. like they had many places they could go with that benefactor story, and I don't really know where they would have went to go. I'm securing these Milky Way reports. Uh -huh. This is the only copy, and I don't want it getting out. Whatever happened was 600 years uh -huh. ago. Someday we might break the news to everyone if the time's right. I guess we always knew there was no going back. Uh, well, that's it. And yeah, there's a revelation that Mom's alive, and we need to go tell the sister, um, so that they can help find the pod or whatever. 
And the travel thing. No, it's not back here. It is this way. Hey, Captain Dunn. Eh, <laughs> Captain That's Dunn. Okay, Captain Dunn with all this bullshit, huh? Thank you. Come on, let's move. Let's move, Ryder. Stop. Stop, stop running. Stop stopping the running, running. What? English, I feel like I can speak it sometimes. Do, 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 do. Charge, Cryo Bay. Uh-huh. Has it? Uh, what, did he, what did he say? Did he say Lisa Farrow? Because that's just not right. That's just not right if that's what he said. That's not That's not the Pathfinder's name. That's not anyone in this game's name. I don't think that's what he said. I think that's just what I heard, and I'm honestly not sure why that's what I heard. Hello? Wait, no, you're not. You're not my sister. Where is she? I don't... I don't remember what she looks like. Oh, wait. No, I'm supposed to go back here. Meet her at the thing, I think. Hello! There you are. Well, if you'll give me a second, I'll tell you what's going on. Well, here's the pod you told me to find. What's so important about Elizabeth Riley? Well, you'll never believe this. If you could have one person back in your life, who would it be? Uh -huh. Um, Mom? No question there. Wait a minute. Yeah? Elizabeth Riley? The initials. E. R. I love how she just accepts this. I saw Dad's like, no, no question, just... E. R. is Do Ellen you Ryder. mean? He brought her along. Sarah, it's Mom. Yeah, do you, do you have any oh actual God. proof of this? How is this possible? Stasis froze her disease. Apparently, putting her into stasis also put her disease on hold. Its progress hey. has been halted. Yeah. Alec put her in stasis after she fell unconscious in the hospital. That sounds like he did this it without amazing. her consent. Dad's stubborn streak finally paid off. I could hug him. And then scream at him. He should have told us about this. Probably, but also at the same time, probably does it not. Really matter? She's still with us. We have to wake her up. That's no. Advisable. Although Ellen is alive, reviving her would trigger the disease, See? which yeah. would be fatal. Well, let's cure her. Can't we cure her, Sam? It's been 600 years. That was well, her father's plan. I mean, yeah, but it's not like we've been advancing. But in Andromeda, we would discover new scientific insights that could provide answers. Uh-huh. Our journeys in Helios have indeed provided valuable genetic knowledge. Uh-huh. Information that could lead to a cure. But it hasn't but yet. Patience is required. For the moment, enjoy the fact that she is still alive. Uh -huh. your accomplishments will one day save her life. Well, but when? But she's right here. How long do we have to wait? A hundred thousand million years. If her life or your father's means anything, we owe them that much. Okay. Sam's right. Give it time. We want to do this right. Really? I wanted to do your things left. Was to ensure the survival of Ellen Ryder. I mean, I, I guess I could try doing things right, but I really wanted to try doing them left. Uh-huh. Touching, isn't it? Well, that's Ryder Family Secrets done, so... I guess with that, uh, I'm going to call it an episode. Thanks for watching, and I hope to see you next time. Hey, look, Tier 6 Research Projects. Anyways, uh, see you next time. Hope you have a good day.